Okay, um, Drake and 21 Savage. Wow. They just dropped a new album. Album is fire, but album is... <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's a matter of uh, opinion. Nah, I, you know, I'm, I'm a big I'm Drake, a Drake fan. fan. I'm going to keep it I'm a, I'm a keep it on it. I'm a Drake fan. I and am. I'm a 21 Savage fan. I am. No, I like them both. I ain't so, got a lot, but he said some stuff on there, bro. I don't... He said some stuff. Ooh. He's, you know... And I'm not used to I'm not used to Drake, you know. Drake is Drake. Drake feeling himself these days. Drake is coming out <laughs> and he he's speaking his mind. <laughs> but you know, I mean, why were you on the Kanye topic? You know, he had some choice words for Kanye. Essentially, he was like, "Yo, you know, Jay Prince got me working with my op. Like, I understand we did the concert together, but." We ain't friends. Like, like that was a business situation right there. Right. What's your thoughts on just the way that that Drake came out, and even him calling out somebody like a Kanye? I think if that's his, if that's his reality, if that's how he feel, he should express it. I think he should express one hundred percent how he feel about things. Now, cheap shots, I don't agree with. Calling Serena Williams' husband the groupie is hard. That's out of line. Yeah, that was harsh. Out of line, yeah. bro. Your, your, your relationship with her, whatever it was, was a long time ago. Now you're making yourself look like a sucker a little bit. Like, like you still hung up on that. That's why you're talking about that. You know what I mean? Like, remember when the thing happened with, with uh, the thing happened with Irv and Ashanti? And yep. everybody was like, yo, Irv, why are you still talking about that? Like, you looking like you hurt, right? That's what that line made him look like. But if you want to clarify some things about what transpired by between you and Kanye, because y'all do have a history of being ops, right? So if you want to clarify that, I'm, I'm all with it. But take a shot to Serena Williams' husband, foul. The little subliminal thing with Megan, foul. Leave, leave the chicks alone. You don't, you don't mess with chicks, bro. If you want to go after other grown men, go ahead. But you leave the ladies out of it, man. That's that's just a rule of manhood. Don't cross the manhood lines. Then we got certain rules of, of being a man. You don't yep. peel a banana and shove the banana in your mouth and eat it. You break <laughs> the banana up. You shake it around like dice and make sure ain't nobody looking at you popping in your mouth. Stop going over the lines of manhood, bro. Leave the women out of it, all right? You still butthurt about Serena. Keep that to yourself. And leave Megan the Stallion out of it. She ain't do nothing to you. She just out here trying to make her money too. That's that's the stuff I don't like. Anybody else that's a dude, you feel like going at him, go at him, bro. I don't care. Go at him.